<laughs> hey. Yeah, dude. We get awards, too. We got some awards. Wow. That's pretty amazing. All righty. Cool. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. We certainly did uh, being a part of the uh, of the evening. Uh, I was just thinking, this band started 33 years ago, three and a half miles down the road in Ballard, and uh, pretty... Uh, Pretty amazing journey that we're still on, and uh, I'd like to thank Jody Allen and the uh, Mopop board, and uh, Leslie Chihuly, the Founders Award Committee as well, uh, Jacob, Brooke, Andrew, the museum staff, the crew, everybody here who's made this possible. Uh, and you know, we'd like to really take a moment and think about the the vision and uh, you know the love of music that Paul Allen had. And uh, it's amazing to be sitting here and to see that tradition continuing too, um, you know, and uh, God, there's so many great artists that are, you know, friends that uh, contributed shout outs and performances. It's It's been a really cool, cool experience. And uh, William, Sean, Mike, and I would like to uh, thank everybody, you know, and uh, as we, accept these awards we want to remember our bandmates as well lane staley and mike Starr, and we got a couple of awards for their families as well and uh wow what a night phil i sean kinney of washington state we're bringing you this for lane i'm bringing you from mo pop mike's founders award thank you thank you Congratulations. Well, thank you. I thank you very much. And uh, on behalf of Lane, uh, I want to thank uh, Alice and uh, Mopop for uh, this uh, uh, prestigious award. Congratulations. And Mike, this is for you. Yes, it is. And Lane and everybody. And Well, it's beautiful, and he'd be thrilled. And I am happy to have it displayed in my home on his behalf. Mike would have drilled a hole in that and made a necklace. <laughs> um, I also want to say that I am truly blessed to be a part of the Alice family. A, a truly blessed. They worked hard and made great music and I, I wish Mike was here to get this himself, but I feel really proud we of him. Back when they first started in the late 80s and they're still going and it's wonderful. They're still, and they're still good. Great music. Yeah. And one thing I do know is that somewhere in this world, somebody for the first time is putting on facelift and being blown away. Wow. Alice is truly eternal and evergreen. Thank you. And when his um, stepbrother said, uh, there's a band holding auditions, and you should go and try out, and they go, well, I'm not a singer. And his stepbrother said, Let's just go try out. And of course, every kid in high school wanted to be a singer in a, in a garage band. So they had lots of people to interview. But after they interviewed Lane, they said, no, nope, that's it. This is the one. He didn't consider himself a singer. He thought he was a drummer. In the, the, uh, the annual mm -hmm. in high school at Highline, he said, I'm going to be a rock star and tour with Van Halen. I'm going to open up my, my band. And he did. Up Van <laughs> <laughs> and that was how many years before? he Only like, it was like within five years they did yeah. actually tour with Van Halen. Yeah. And that's pretty so, cool. He was focused. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations, cool. Alice. That's wonderful.